Ryan Murphy is clarifying that he and his team had reached out to many of the families and friends of Jeffrey Dahmer's victims in preparing for the Netflix series about the infamous serial killer. At an event for the show in Los Angeles on Thursday, Murphy noted, over the course of the three, three and a half years when we were really writing it, working on it, we reached out to 20, around 20 of the victims' families and friends, trying to get input, trying to talk to people, and not a single person responded to us in that process. Between 1978 and 1991, Dahmer gruesomely murdered 17 men. The show's description says the series is centered on the underserved victims and their communities impacted by the systemic racism and institutional failures of the police that allowed one of America's most notorious serial killers to continue his murderous spree in plain sight for over a decade. I'm just trying to say I'm sorry. Is she going to open your gift? However, the show has been criticized for the heavy focus on Dahmer's horrifying behavior and framing of the victim's stories. The series also received backlash from victims' families, some of whom have accused the streamer and the team for not reaching out to them. However, Murphy explained, we weren't so much interested in Jeffrey Dahmer, the person, but what made him the monster that he became. It's really about white privilege. It's about systemic racism. It's about homophobia. When the topic of a possible memorial being set up for the victims was brought up, Murphy added, I do think there should be something, and we're trying to get a hold of people to talk about that, and also noted, I would even be happy to pay for it myself. Dahmer, Monster, the Jeffrey Dahmer story is streaming now on Netflix. For much more details on this story, including Murphy's process of working with Dahmer star Evan Peters, head to the article on THR.com. And for the latest entertainment news and updates, keep watching The Hollywood Reporter News. Thank <laughs> you.